All right. This is the next project. So, I mean, the same thing basically, but a little different. This time we're going to do something with a car. So, I'm going to make my camera. Camera, right click, camera calibrator, click on this, image. Let's get our image. Yeah, I'll do, no, I'll do this one. All right, so we have this right here. You can click on this full image thing. Go to calibrate, let's go to add grid. You have the grid right here. Let's lay out the grid points. Let's say, let's go right here. Let's go right here. Here. And then as you can see, it can be a few different ways. Let's just do this. Okay. Let me do shift, click on this. Shift, click on this one. It's green, shift, click on it one more time. Cool, we have this. Create background object. the camera mapping tag. Now we'll click this and now we're inside. Of our camera, which is on the grid. And to see that fully, we just go here. You can kind of see the grid on the background. All right. So that we have this, you know, and I lock it just because um, rigging projection. Now I'm going to bring in a plane to put right here. So let's get out of the camera, right? Let's hide this. Now let's look, right? Now we see the, the click S. This is now here. So let me go and get a plane and I'll put the plane in front of the camera, get back in the camera, click on this. Now set this up to be the street. Okay, let's get out of it, let's hide it. Now we're gonna bring in our object, right? Which I'll give to you all, merge objects. Uh, class, we'll go to this Lambo, right? Okay, I'll press S, there I am, click on this, delete it. Here we go, our Lambo. Press T to scale. Scaling it up. Uh, S again. Where's it? O. Okay. Let me go in this orthographic view. All right, so put them there. Uh, here. Now it's on top of the grid. T. Click shift. Okay. Now we're back in this view. Now we're inside of our camera. Now let's turn on our background object. All 
Okay, so we got our plane, this control click, background object. Oh, and this is what I meant to, uh, oh, you know, I'll go into that early, later. But sort of kind of like how this is our object and we copy this. It's kind of like just replacing something in the folder. All right. So now that we have this, we can do things like go down here. So it already has our material set up. We can kind of just choose it. So we can go to this car paint right here and change it. Mess with this reflectance. Let's go ahead and give a quick render. All right, we see what it looks like. The ground plane has that on it. Oh, we need to do a compositing tag. So, um, what is it? Uh, yeah, compositing. Compositing background. Play it again. And just because, let's do these tires. Make them like a rubber. Uh, GX. Find a nice, this rubber looking color. Go ahead, get ourselves a sky dome and control click. Oh, no, no, wait. This control click and let's change this one to HDRI. Right click, copy on the color, go to luminance, paste, HDRI in the sky dome. Right click. Compositing, check. Seen by camera. Play, okay. Wait, so that was our sky dome. So let's get out of here. Press S. Take off this. Now let's mess with this. Go in and get some PBR lights. Go in here, we'll go to physical. Effect ambient, effect global. Play. Let's mess with this some more. Okay, let's say I don't want to see this so much. I want to make another one just to test it. Not that another sky. 
Let's make another HDI. Uh, HDR. Let's just choose this random one. I have no idea what it is. Same thing here. Seen by camera. Okay. I'm just trying to get this a bit shinier. Just got to mess with these lights a little bit more. 